Hey, what's going on, guys? So, uh, I just had to try something new because I was a little bored, and uh, I'm on Amigo right now, and I am doing the uh, the spy question mode where you can uh, ask a question, and two people can argue about or talk about your question and answer it. And uh, I decided to uh, see what would happen if uh, I told them to tell a story one word at a time. So, uh, let's see what kind of funny stories we can get out of people. All right, going. It's going off for a good start here. All right, boobs are what? Boobs are my favorite. All right, you can tell unless one of them's a lesbian. These two strangers are guys. Boobs are my favorite thing too. Oh God, squeeze. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm so glad I get bored and decide to do stuff like this. When girls are naked, Amigo, full of pervs, the girls are naked. Aww. Jake went to the store. Wow, what an interesting story. Jake went to the store and got some condoms because his girlfriend wanted to have an anal. Okay, all right, mixing it up. Anal and she wanted to do it. Okay, so Jake went to the store and got some condoms because his girlfriend wanted to have anal and she wanted to do it with no one giving her a penis. What? Wait, wait, wait. Girlfriend wanted to have anal and she wanted to do it with no one giving her a penis based organ. What? What the fuck? <laughs> Penis based organ. With no one giving her a penis based organ. Story is getting out of hand, so. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. I'm. I'm going to pee on you. <laughs> I'm going to pee on you tonight. Disconnected. <laughs> I don't know why this is so entertaining. <sighs> his dick and her and. Oh, his dick and her and pussy. Are you guys going with us? And disconnected. I guess I'm kind of glad that one of them got disconnected because I wouldn't want to know how that story would unfold. Okay, well, that's a good start of the story. Okay. I don't want to. What a poor sport. You're a big, fat, motherfucking ass. You're a big motherfucking ass and you... This is such a nice story. You're a big fat motherfucking ass, and you are a fat, slutty, hopeless cunt. The ops are. Oh, operators, okay. Okay, this story isn't getting anywhere. There was. There was a man who had. There was a man who had. Oh, that story was getting intense. <laughs> One, two. The story's getting intense. One, two, three, four, A, B. One, two, three, four, A, B fell. Got up. You suck at this. <laughs> that was a good story. One time I killed a man once with the shoe. Nigga, one word. <laughs> That's racist. Come on. I didn't say that word. He was actually an action figure. I stepped on him. My son cried. Called me a murderer. My wife left me. This is so sad. Took the children. Took the house. Took my life. Now I spend every Sunday rolling in my mayonnaise. 
I wonder if that story is true. If that's true, I feel really bad for Stranger 1. But, I mean, on the bright side, though, he, he does have mayonnaise. I mean, he doesn't have his children or his house or his wife, but he at least he has mayonnaise. I mean, that's, that's the only thing we need in life, you know? We only need mayonnaise to keep us happy. And when you roll around in mayonnaise, that's just, it, it's better than sex, you know? Alright, well, it looks like story, Stranger 2 doesn't have a story, so we'll just continue on. Didn't we start with this word before? Pretty sure we did. It's not a bad word to start with, though. You know, this can definitely, this word can definitely branch off to different, different types of stories, you know? It can, it can branch off to many possibilities to a really good story. This, this could be, this could be the start of a novel. Stranger 1 could be a novelist. I mean, you never know. Boobs are made in Stranger 2. You got the stage. Teach us the wondrous ways of where boobs are made. Boobs are made in the best. Boobs are made in the best spring. Okay. I'm gonna just go ahead and start a new one. Suck everyone sucks dick. Suck everyone sucks dick. My dad sucks. Suck everyone sucks dick. My dad sucks my nine inch penis every day. It's <laughs> a good story. All right, I'm gonna tell you a story that might change your life. Once, there was a giant turtle that liked farting. It ate beans that were poisonous. The end. Good story. Good story. That could be book material. That could be in a novel. The cow leaped over my truck. And then it gave me herpes. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to say this uh, story in a straight face. All right. <laughs> A dog wants to fuck me in the ass with his dick, and I will. That's a good story. Okay, I guess Stranger 1 only has the floor on this one. Penis is long and whoops. Mm -hmm. Once upon a time, the stranger disconnected. It was based on a true story. Once upon a time, there wasn't a story. Clearly. <laughs> Once upon a banana, didn't expect that plot twist, did ya? Once upon a banana, there happened a man and a very sneaky long banana. Case closed. Alright, that's all I have time for. Yeah, if you guys enjoyed or if this has definitely made you laugh or if you enjoyed the stories that people have told, please uh, leave a like and comment below. Let me know if you guys want to see any more episodes of this. And yeah, that is pretty much it. I will see you guys next time. Peace. Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, so you guys all know the game Flappenberg, and they just came out with multiplayer on the computer, the multiplayer version of Flappenberg, uh, and this is what it looks like. And, uh, I saw someone else play it, and I was like, man, I gotta try this. So um, yeah, they made a freaking multiplayer of it.